poem lattes. Hey guys, this is like an instructional video to do gymnastics and crap. And yes, I'm wearing a skirt. This, a skirt, not a skirt. That was weird. Okay, so, that's really annoying. Okay, so first, we're gonna do cartwheel. Pretty simple, no cartwheel. Yes, <sighs> yes. The are gonna come, oh my god, so gross, wearing a skirt and doing that. It's a skirt, it's a skirt. See the shorts, see the shorts, shorts, shorts under the skirt. Jesus Christ. Also called a scooter. Okay, yes. I don't know if you can see my face though. You carp with me. So, first I'll show a quick one. And now I'll do like another one to show you the experience. Or, it didn't break anything. What are you talking about? Okay. That's how you do cut up. So first, you like throw up your hands, like put your nails, that's what I can ask you to just call it. So, show up your nails, you put your toe. So, go one, and then you like, you lean forward on the, like, if you're lefty or righty, I'm a righty, so whenever I say use your right foot, I mean, just use your left foot if you're lefty or right foot if you're right. But it doesn't really matter. So, show off your nails, move forward, and your right foot. And put your other one straight in the back and kind of push off on your toe. Like, you should feel like you're falling, like, forward and, like, kind of jumping a little bit. And try and hold the middle position. Like as long as you can, so it's like getting strapped or something. Yeah. And land these tops like that. So you just, when you're like landing, you kind of switch your positions and you should land in the same position that you started in. You can kind of pivot. Because if you do another one like this, like if you land like this, it's just switched. Like, it's the same position you're starting with, with your wrong foot. I can do both legs. I don't know about you guys, but, um, uh, I can do both. It's pretty hard. This is my first one. Oh, uh, yeah. See, now we're okay. That's my bad leg. Like, my wrong arm, my wrong foot. Uh, okay. So, this is how you do it one more time. Show up your nails, and pour in your strong leg, push off with your toes, and kind of like guide your first foot over first, and then your other one will kind of like follow you. And uh, yeah, here's how to do it with one hand. So first, some people like to sit like this, and like put their hands like over each other, and then hold one of them, or like Actually, no, don't hold them because my fingers will get crushed and don't sue me, they get hurt. So, yeah, so put your hands like this, flat on each other, your fingers, and like the faces of your other fingers, and first you have to get your heart out. And you do the same thing, and that way if you get scared, you can just switch your hand over. And another way you can do it is like if you know that you can do it, like you have the strength and you're just scared, you can um, put your hands like high my shirt tied, so it might be like easy for me, but go put your hand like this behind your back and do it. So that way you don't have like an urge to put your hand down. And you can go like this. And land. For some people, if they're scared, like just a little bit, they can go like this and circle. I think that's quite cool. But, you know, some people are like, wow, okay. So that's how you circle. You push off, then right when you're pushing off, like right when your toe is about to go off, your hands should be equal. Like you're going to get rid of the carpet. So it's like, and then you go into it and you circle like this.
and just circle the whole thing, and your hand will never touch as long as you have the strength to do. Um, yeah. So, I'm going to make some more in a little bit.